Tonight we'll be going through the under-13 teams at Glen Waverley. We entered four sides this year and it was great to see so many new families as well as kids from the under-11s coming up and developing even more. The under-13s were very successful with three of the teams making the semi-finals and the under-13 Friday Green just falling short in the, in the grand final. It was a great season by all that participated and I'd like to thank all the coaches and parents for their hard work and support. Hello everyone, I'm Tushar Bagu, Under-13 Friday Green Stage 2 coach. I'm going to announce Junior Trophy winners for this season. Our batting average winner is Pratham Geethe, 190 runs with batting average of 99.5. Our bowling average winner is Nevin Parera, 13 wickets with average of 3.8. Most improved player is Roshan Seni Viratne. And the coach's award goes to Adisha Mianandani. Hello everyone, my name is Sunil. I have coached under 13's Friday mixed team for boys and girls. First of all, I thanks Ash for giving an opportunity and all the parents for their splendid support. Though we didn't get the result we wanted, we all had fun, had a great season and appreciate each and every player for their fantastic effort. The awards now. The batting award goes to Zara Sheikh with 77 runs at an average of 25.67. Well done Zara. The bowling award goes to Harrison Pierce with 5 wickets at an average of 17.80. Well done Harry. The coaches award goes to Mike Maraxis. Started patchy but great improvement and finished the season fantastic. Well done everybody. Thank you again. Hi, I'm Jess, the team manager for under 13 Saturday boys playing for the Graham Fisher Shield. I knew we were in for a cracking season with such a great group of boys full of energy, passionate about cricket, and in our very first match, Omar getting a hat trick. There was no doubt these boys wanted to win and set their standards high, both individually and as a team. The team had many great matches, but my season highlight was setting an amazing target of three for 255 with both Salil and Cooper scoring 50s. Their success continued throughout the season with the team reaching the semi-finals, but unfortunately falling short to the eventual champions. A big thank you goes to Alex for coaching the boys and sharing your obvious passion for the game. We appreciate all of your effort. When I asked Zach for a comment about you, he said you were the best coach ever and I think the rest of the team would agree. Thank you also to all of the parents for supporting the team this season, with a special mention to Steve for always being prepared to score for the team every week. Well done to the boys. You should all be very proud of yourself and I'm looking forward to watching you next season. Now for some awards. The first award is for best batting. This award goes to a player who doesn't say a lot, but lets his bat do the talking. He sets a high standard for himself and scored a total of 113 with an average of 56.5. Congratulations to Googie. The next award is for best bowling. Another quiet achiever in our team that always finds a way to get wickets frequently. Taking seven wickets this season with an average of 8.57. Congratulations to Suchith. Next is the most improved player award. This player may be the smallest in our team, but he always puts in a big effort. As the season went on, he looked more confident in all aspects, scoring 60 runs, taking three wickets, a catch and two runouts. Congratulations to Adi. And finally, the Coach's Choice Award. This player top scored this year with 156 runs and has committed to working on his wicket keeping skills, as well as leading his team on field from behind the stumps. And with a previously mentioned top score of 50, our congratulations go to Cooper. The next team is under 13 Saturday Gold, coached by Viraj Sevenratney. They had a great season, reaching it all the way to the semi-finals for the first time. The batting award goes to Pratham Guy with 139 runs and an average of 34.75. A great player to have in the team, true competitor, mostly important, a great team player. He's always encouraging his teammates, Keep doing what you're doing and you'll go a long way. The next award is the Bowling Award and goes to Venuja Galindi with 7 wickets at an average of 15.43. He's the baby in the team but he's absolutely giving everything 
when he has the ball in his hands. He's always showed great sportsmanship towards other players and pushed himself to take the team over the line regardless whether he is batting or bowling. The all-round reward goes to Sean Averma with 119 runs, an average of 23 and 5 wickets at 18. A great all-rounder to have in the team, fantastic team player and sportsman. Keep pushing and trying to be more consistent with bat and ball and pretty sure you'll be an absolute go. The coach's award goes to Ibrahim Urshad. He's always pushing himself to be better and improve. He gave absolutely everything to the team, most importantly, and a great team player who always gave everything to the team.